Good morning. <sighs> Monday morning. Week three, I think, of school, maybe. It didn't go so well. So this morning, I was walking to school, kind of rushing the kids, realising that we'd kind of left it a little bit too late to give my son an opportunity to have a play at the playground and I was stressing about it and I was thinking oh I shouldn't have had that morning sex that I had this morning and should have been more organized and I was just walking across the road walking along the road and this woman yelled out which had two kids in a pram and she yelled out excuse me I'm listening to you right now like and pointing at her um pointing at her headphones and it, and I was just like I, I don't know it was just the most weirdest feeling to 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 hear that and anyway she said thank you guys so much you're awesome and I it was I was so struck by the irony of me in that moment beating myself up feeling stressed trying to think about how I can prepare my mornings better so that everybody feels much more filled up and that our school transition can be a bit smoother and here we have somebody loving on the podcast and saying how great it is and I thought in that moment I thought I've got to get on here and turn it into a message for everyone for every mother for every woman who is trying to show Please up in her world forward. is that it's Please okay not to have the answers it's okay to be figuring stuff out you don't have to have the 411 on everything to be able to use your voice because we don't and we're figuring it out and we're sharing how we're figuring it out along the way and there's power in that and I think that what what works so well for our community is that it's that safety in terms of um, being vulnerable enough to share your journey in it all and creating um, a space for us to go deep, creating space for us to lean in and, and look at the bigger picture and find our values and stick to them and you know like anchor into who we are so we can anchor our kids better like I had to in the playground today when my son didn't want to go to school again and he's melting down an assembly and wanting a hug and me staying really true to my values which was which was to allow that in that moment and to not feel the pressure from teachers that I needed to make him quiet or that I needed to leave so that he didn't create more of a scene you know to really respect everybody in the room and respect those around you but also stay true to yourself and so I guess I want to say thank you to that listener this morning because I needed that. Um, and we never know the ripples that we're creating um, through the work that we do, through who we are, through how we show up. So I hope you have a great Monday and a great week ahead. And I just wanted to say thanks to that listener. So see you.